he has some valid points. Accountability and, and, and responsibility has to be done. But we have to look at what's going on. You can only back a person into a corner for so long before they lash out. And, and, and I feel like that's really what's going on across the nation, whether it's Oscar Grant, whether it's this, whether it's people who not even getting noticed, people are getting killed and they're people of color. Mm -hmm. People are sick and tired of stuff going on and, and no justice is being, um, uh, you know, no justice is, is coming about. So it's misplaced anger, the rioting, they're upset. This is this this the the past repeats itself. This is the same thing that happened, you know, with the LA riots. It's the same thing that happened in the 50s, 60s, 70s, up into the 80s, until the, the Black uh, Panthers came along and organized. This is pe black people, people of color. I'm not even gonna say just black people, people of color. And I'm talking about people of color, Asians, Latinos, Mexicans have been facing injustices here in America for the longest. I am sick and tired of police officers getting away with behaving the way that they behave. Freddie Gray is not the first person to be apprehended, put in a paddy wagon, and killed. Then you have the medical examiner, which I commend, and like he said, Ms. Mosby, who bring forth the truth of this man was handcuffed. He was already apprehended, but his spinal cord was severed. How does that happen? So then the first thing comes out, oh, well, he did it to himself. Then the medical examiner goes on to say, no, there's no possible way that he could have did it himself. With his arms behind his back, no matter if he was hitting his head up against the, 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 the window. So what you see seeing in Baltimore is people in outrage and people are frustrated. Does that, is that justification for going and destroying neighborhoods? No, it's not. But do we get upset when a volcano erupts or do we just understand that the volcano reached its, its pressure and it just erupted? This is what you're saying. I, 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 I compare it to a volcano. People have sat back, whether it was Trayvon, whether it's Oscar Grant, whether it was all of these black males who've been killed since senseless, um, senseless. Um, to, to police brutality and all they get is a paid vacation charges are brought up against them and either they're dropped or they're found not guilty people are outraged about this now if we flip that and make this a white person thing and if this was going on you don't think white people would be uniting white people would be burning down and doing that like my thing is when people want to talk about rioting what happens after the Stanley Cup what happens after the, the, the Rose Bowl, after a, a, a team is lost in college sports? White people do it on college campuses all the time. But nobody's speaking on that. $5 million worth of damage, but when we do it out of anger and frustration, we're not doing this just because. We mad. We sick and tired of being treated unequal to everybody else. Mm. That's really what's going on. All we want is to be treated equal. This is not about race. This is about being fair across the board. I don't believe in the justice system at all. We black people, African people, people of color make up 14% of the, the, the population of the world. Question. No, then why did the white people go out and do the same thing as what you're saying is okay for black people to go and do? Because not one time those people went out there and got beat and got bit by dogs and all of that. Not one time did they have any violent protest. Not one time. Exactly, because they and believe Martin in Martin. King, Martin Luther King right. changed the world. Now, you can't stop people from being racist. You can't stop from cops going to get badges that don't need none. Like I said, I can name black Black officers that were nothing but felons and crooks. Exactly. Nothing at all. What I can't I'm saying too. is, okay, but what I'm saying is, it's it's a cop thing. It's not a race thing, but you said, we well, like they're going out and just killing black people. They ain't doing that. Yes, they are. Okay. Are they not? 414 white people was killed. But, but do we know how? How That is an open ended question. Well, yeah, well, but how can you state a fact? Let's deal with the facts. Well, Let's not deal with half truths. You don't have any facts. What, what facts do you the got? facts that you have just presented were all things that you got from the news. But, okay, so my question, uh, from what I got what? from the news, 
right? But what do we see? Freddie Gray on the news. Uh, Brown on the news. You weren't there. You ain't even in Baltimore. Right. You exactly. So what? So, you, wait, 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 wait. Let me finish. Let me finish my point. What you got is in the news. So what? Not at all. Wait, wait, wait. You got it because uh, okay. My question to you: Were you were you there when no. when Freddie Gray got no. arrested? Was you there when Mike Brown got arrested? No. So my thing of it is, you know what was in the news, not from what you know from personal experience. You don't know none of that. What I what I'm you saying is what I'm so saying is this. So what you're saying is it's the truth because you want it to be the no, truth. No, not, not at all. Yeah, you're not letting me. You're not letting me say. But what you I'm, say you let were me say about what that. I have to I say and that. then refute what I have to say. Okay, what I'm saying is this on the news. Who do you see throwing rocks? You see black, black people throwing rocks, right? This is a direct representation of the white media manipulating like they want you to. It's more, it's a lot of white people down there doing the same exact thing, but you don't see them. But you come on. You can't so say, so you okay, can't but let me finish. I, I didn't I didn't interrupt you. People. Okay, so let me so let me flip it and, and then let's take it. Uh, I wasn't there. That's why when I made the, I, I didn't, I didn't jump out the window like everybody else on Facebook. I said I'm gonna sit back and and, and make it a, and, and speak on it because people was like, dang, Rashala, why you ain't speaking on it? I want to hear what what's your take on it. And I'm like, no, I'm gonna sit back and actually gather more facts about the situation. I commend the the, the, the black mayor and all of them, and I hope that justice is thing. But I understand what the people were saying. Because that could have been anybody. People don't want to speak on us. People don't want to relate to it until it's them. Then all of a sudden, oh, my son this, my son that. No, th that's your brother out there who was unjust. I'm not talking about how he was arrested. Yeah, if he was resisting, he deserved to have his leg flipped up. We're talking about what happened in the back of the paddy wagon. Okay, yes, they're trying to bring up about those uh, uh, the, the, the convictions of those officers. It's not a black or white thing because, it's, like you said, it's corrupt on both sides. What I'm talking about is I understand the people and the people. This is not this is not something that's just been going on in the six. This has been going on for hundreds and hundreds of years. The people are sick and tired. I'm not saying that Martin Luther King, Martin Luther King was a great person. He changed the world. He did. But he only applied one philosophy. So let's, let's take it to the other side. Malcolm X applied a great philosophy too. We're not going to sit here and just take this. But you, but what? Who's, That's who, why who's, he was killed. Okay, yeah. well, what was Martin Luther King killed for? He was killed too. He was killed by Martin Luther Mar Malcolm X was killed by a black person. No, he was assassinated by a black person. To kill you don't mean that it, I didn't send the head. A white person. I didn't send the head. Like, come on, man. Are, are we serious? Are we denoting? Hold on. Are we denoting Malcolm X's legacy because he, he because he chose to go hard for his people? No, he no. switched up. No, are you serious? He switched up. You can look at it in his movie. It was, no, oh my God, are we really global. dumbing everything no, down white, to a movie? No, who race, who makes the movies in America? Who uh, no, 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 wait, 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 who made Malcolm X? Spike, Spike Lee. Lee. By Spike Lee, black. Okay, but oh my but, goodness. But would you? Stop but it. he had to get the political correct. Right. He shot Chris that. Rock talks no, about this on right now. Political correct no. when it came to Malcolm X. No, I just think no, that. He you know, didn't. I, like I said, I'm just trying to dumb that down. No, not at all. He, I'm not. I'm not going off the movie. He did the Malcolm X movie. Malcolm X was about every white person was a devil. Then he switched. Not at all. Yes, he did. What? Are you serious? Okay, like I said, it's not arguing me. I'm not saying. Are we? Are we? No. Me and Malcolm X was just as important, if not more important, as Martin Luther King. Right. That's why he didn't do nothing. Oh, oh my God! I'm, I'm walking away, brother. <laughs> hey, <laughs> all right. <laughs> this, that, that, Malcolm X didn't do anything. Are you serious? Oh my goodness! All right. Well, are you serious? T O T O. Answer this. If I hit you in the jaw, what you gonna do? You gonna hit me back in the jaw, right? Right. Are you gonna sit there and just take it? Can't turn another cheek. Right. Exactly. What's his name? Um, who was over the money? You wasting your breath because the man just said. You wasting your breath. You wasting your breath. Malcolm X was assassinated because of stuff he was saying. Right. Exactly. And he was telling the truth. No, he was assassinated by a black person. But why? This. Come on, man. This is coming. He believes, but but he believes in the system. So you 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 going? It's a bigger thing going on here, and he not seeing it. And that's his opinion. I'm seeing it. Not at all. Okay. We can go round and round about this. Right. I mean, but like I said, I gotta go. I know you gotta go. <laughs> so I mean, come on, man. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I'm, 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 I'm,
serious? I hear what the black people are saying in Baltimore and around the world. I'm not saying I feel their pain. Right. My thing is, what I'm saying is, violence don't solve anything. No, right. No, no, no. Peaceful you protesting didn't did either. Right. Peaceful protesting didn't either. Martin Luther King. But you got your swollen jaw and some legs. So basically, no, no. So basically, feel me? Just said. Please believe that somehow, some way, we gotta make it about the hood someday.